It's the Serpent Center Showdown. The Bushmasters versus the Further Lands. Fangs in your face, coming up. Bangs in your face. Subscribe now. Hey, before we get started, I want to say a big thank you to all of our generous supporters, all of our contributors, the exhibit sponsors. For those of you who don't know us, we're in the midst of building a Serpentarium here. We're almost there. We're almost done. We'll be opening pretty soon. But And also, a big thank you to people that send us the, the super thanks. The new thing on YouTube, the super thanks. They kind of send you a little... A tip <laughs> but uh thank you so much we got some dynamite fangs in your face coming up we fed a bunch of stuff on exhibit so we filmed it for y'all just a quick fun one so I hope you guys enjoy it we had fun doing it we haven't been doing as many videos because we're working and it's baby season so all the bothrops are starting to give birth we got baby alternators born which is the Arutus baby Mujani is born a little further Lance maybe Dina can pop some little skits in there that, of some of the baby stuff we've been doing. Well, first snake born on exhibit at the Serpent Center. Bothrops alternatus. The Arutus. Some big babies. A couple of them ain't busted out of the sack yet. <clears throat> This little guy, he's like, hey Will, welcome to the world, buddy. Let's get ready to push one out here in a minute. Got three of them up there in the corner, one here. <laughs> this little guy right here. There's one of our little Bothrops Mugeni mamas. He just dropped a letter of babies. He started early this morning. I left her be. She looks like she's done now, but you can never tell. She's a big snake to begin with. But I can see about 10 of them in there so far. But we'll go ahead and pull her out and do a head count. See what we got. probably about 10 of them underneath that log right there. That's where they go every year. They bury up underneath that flat log. So, time to get at it. So this is gonna be the Bothrops versus the Lachesis. The damn Bushmasters are on target. So are the Bothrops. But you go ahead and decide who you think is the most accurate, who is the fastest, who is the meanest, who is the baddest. Hey, hang in there. Fangs in your face is coming up. Okay, we're gonna jump into some fangs in your face action. We're gonna feed the Bothrops and some of the Bushmasters tonight here at the Serpent Center. And we got a little mama there. She's hiding behind a, a fern. Let's see if we can lure her out here for a strike. Oh, ho, 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 ho. big bite. There you go, baby. Oh. 
But now she's gaping. <laughs> she's mad. That a girl. And set your mouse down for you right there. Let her come over there and enjoy that. Now this is this snake just had babies on exhibit. This is a Bothrops alternatus the root to. She just had a nice big litter of babies. And let me tell you, it was a chore finding all them babies in this exhibit. It was not easy. <laughs> I had one get up in that log and I didn't know he was in there until a day later. <laughs> but uh Anyways, this is the Fertilance versus the Bushmasters tonight. Who's the meanest? Who's the fastest? Who's the most accurate? We'll rate that one at about a scale of 1 to 10. I would say a 6. Okay, for our next snake that we're going to feed, this is the Bothrops Laocorus. Also known as the White-tailed Lancehead Pit Viper. And this is the male. He's a, he's a little bugger. You can see his head kind of through them vines. We're going to see if we can get him to reach out through them vines and come put a love tap on this rodent. Oh, there you go, buddy. see him in the twisted up vine in there but he might bite it again you want to bite it again buddy nope all right bump it back big guy we'll set that right there for you that is the bothrop flag course and we'll rate that one at about a five. He's kind of a gentle boy. Okay, and for our next animal, this is the Brazilian Lancet, also known as the Bothros Mugeni. And this snake is just flat out dangerous. So we gotta try to lure her over here. Come on, big girl. Oh, 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 oh she come a long way for that. Goodness, <laughs> and fast as grease, lightning. Oh, hard 10. That's a hard 10 right there. And the Mugenai always deliver, boy. They are something else. What a fierce snake. Always on target and super aggressive when it comes to feeding, when it comes to anything. This is a dangerous animal. The Mugenai is nothing to play with. Let's get you back up in there. Okay, we're going to go in on a big Bushmaster now. And this is your South American Bushmaster. This is the Lachesis Muda. And I think this Lachesis right now is in blue. But he's tucked way back up there in the corner. So we got to lure him all the way out here. Because he's back there about four or five foot. Send him some vibration. I can't reach up in there for him. He's gonna have to come get it. Oh, he's on it. Oh, he's on it now. Here he comes. Oh, here he, Oh, he's coming in hot. Look at that. Oh, that is cool. Oh, 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 hard 10. Hard 10. That was awesome. That was 
awesome. And this guy is in blue. He is in shed. And look at that pinpoint accuracy of that strike. He may even do a double tap. Sometimes he'll bang him twice. The second time he'll hang on. If not, I just set it down and he'll come in there and get it. He'll come over and eat it. Oh, that was awesome. That's the Bushmaster, your South American Bushmaster, Lachesis Muda. Okay, we're going to go in on his big Bushmaster, and he is up there ready to rock and roll. Look at him. All right, buddy. Austin Smith, this is your boy. This is Aries, the God of War. Look at him. He is tensed up. He is ready to roll. Oh, yeah. That's a good boy. That is 22 pounds and 8 foot of Lachesis melanosophila of the black-headed Bushmaster right there. And this guy ain't easy to do the fangs in your face with because he's rather long and he's rather gnarly. And if you make one mistake, that's it. You're done. That is one big Bushmaster right there. Okay, we have one more monster for the lance to feed here. We got this big six foot Bothrop play of course. And she's way back up in there. We gotta try to lure her out here. Need to give her a little bit of tap here. See if we can draw her in. Let her get close enough to pick up a heat signature. <laughs> there you go, girl. in this exhibit and I kind of backed up a little bit because I was repositioning my foot <laughs> and she reached out and tapped it but uneventful but it might look really cool in the slow-mo so we'll give that one a five there you go big girl enjoy your rat sweetie and she is loving her jungle So what do y'all think? The Bushmaster or the Fur de Lance or the Bothrops? Which is it? Uh, for me, it's the Bushmaster. That is the pinpoint accuracy. I mean, that Muda, he come a long way. He come four foot across that cage, up in the air, in blue. His eyes are blued over, getting ready to shit, and he hit his target on the money. If you're new to the channel, hit that V logo thing and subscribe now, and come on back and check us out at Venom Central and the Serpent Center coming soon. This is Willie from Venom Central. We're checking out. Later.